We have new developments into the search for a wanted Janesville man that has left communities in Wisconsin worried for their safety. NBC26's Emily Beyer is live in studio with more for us. Emily? Brooke, it's now been one week since police say Joseph Jakubowski broke into Armageddon Supplies, set his car on fire and disappeared. Now felony burglary charges have been filed against him. The criminal complaint says he used a hammer to break a window and in just four minutes got away with 18 guns, silencers, a bulletproof vest and ammunition. Hours before breaking into the gun store, Jakubowski mailed a manifesto to President Donald Trump, which has been arrived at the White House. Poli According to police, Jakubowski's sister found an apology letter in his bedroom addressed to the owner of Armageddon Supplies, saying, quote, he wanted to purchase the guns to protect himself and his family, but as a felon was not allowed to do so, end quote. He apologized for stealing and thanked him for protecting Second Amendment rights. Police say they don't know where he is. A retired FBI fugitive profiler believes he will act out. We're dealing with someone who's mission oriented. That means they are intent on following through with whatever they decided to do. And their judgment is flawed. And in the end, with many manifesto um, offenders, they're prepared to die for their cause. Authorities now releasing images of what Jakubowski would look like if he shaved his head and goatee and photos of his tattoos. The FBI has increased its reward to $20,000 for any information leading to Jakubowski's arrest. If you see him, do not approach him and contact police immediately. Reporting live in studio, Emily Beyer, NBC26.